Hi there everyone, Shauna Randolph here, spokesperson of the Edmonton Humane Society with your first This Week at the EHS for 2013. And we start the year off with two touching medical stories to deal with animals here in our shelter. One, a surgery we did on a guinea pig and another one, a dog who had his paw caught in a trap. This is Henry, the one-year-old shepherd mix who came to the Edmonton Humane Society after being found as a stray north of Edmonton. The poor guy's little foot had been caught in a trap and his toes mangled. To top it off, for some reason, his head was continuously tilting to the side and still is. Our medical staff members have been working at solving the mystery around it, whether it's a neurological issue or perhaps an inner ear infection. As for the foot, off to surgery Henry went to have the remaining toes amputated in order for him to have any chance at a good quality of life. Our medical experts are confident that he'll be okay without his toes, but he'll still need a bit of rehabilitation and guidance to compensate. We'll keep you posted on Henry's progress. Then there's Bella, the two-year-old guinea pig who was admitted by his owners mainly due to allergies in late December. She had a huge cyst on her head, which almost looked like a second head. Not cancerous, but still needing to be removed. Would have kept growing and would have caused pressure and pain and it, it would have gotten infected sooner or later. So off to surgery Bella went and it's rare for us to do an operation of this type on a guinea pig. She wouldn't be adoptable otherwise um, or if we did adopt her out and somebody had a you know was willing to take her she would have pain um, at some point due to the cyst so we can take it out and then she won't have any pain and then she's adoptable someone can give her a home. The surgery went very well and sweet Bella recovered quickly and then went into foster care to recover before she'll be placed up for adoption. She'll be ready for a new family and new love, not even realizing just how lucky she is. Two very lucky pets indeed and we will keep you updated about their progress on our social media site so stay tuned. That's your Week in Review. Join us again next time.